Hey y'all, I'm here to show you a quick tip of how to prepare a lobster tail. We're not gonna dispatch any live lobsters today. We're just gonna get some lobster tails and pop them out of the shell so you can throw them on the grill or under the broiler. And that will explain why I have these gloves on. Let's get to busy. All right, so we have our lobster tails here. This one I've already prepared. This looks like you're at a restaurant, right? Pretty easy. All you're gonna do is take some kitchen shears, and I would use some sturdy ones, and cut straight down the back, all the way to the tail. There you go. So I've cut it. Some lobsters will have what's called a mud vein, which is like, you know, what shrimp have. If it has one, it will be pretty obvious and you can pull it out very easily. But this is why you have the gloves. All you do is put your fingers down in between the shell and the meat. Let's see if we can get a good view. And you're gonna push the meat out with your thumbs. All right, so once it pops out, there you go. You lay it right on top. There's that mud vein I talked about. Take that out, throw that away. And look how pretty, looks just like restaurant style. All right, let's do the same with this one. Scissors. Cut straight back. You'll see the meat inside. This one doesn't seem to have a mud vein. And pop the meat out. And then the shells are very, very tough so they can cut your fingers. I'm just gonna pull it out and pop it on top, just like the other one. And we are ready to season them up. And I'm gonna head to the grill with mine. So simply all you'll need is some kosher salt here. And I like to use a little bit of my European blend seasoning. They take about five minutes on the grill, if you have your grill really, really hot and they'll turn bright, bright red, and the meat will turn pink. Now you don't want to overcut lo cooked lobster because it'd be very, very tough. And we want it tender and moist. So let's take my gloves off. Season these up with some salt. A little bit of European blend. You can get this at tinacanningcooks.com. And I'm gonna head out to the grill now. Bye.